from Slum Pip. How are you? Uh, all right, I suppose. Ramadan Kareem. You seem a bit quiet this morning. Mm. How's the fasting going for you? Yeah. Uh huh. I'm totally cream cracking. Oh. You know this fasting thing doesn't suit me. Oh. You know it's too hard. And I think I only fasted for half the day yesterday. I'm, I'm only six after all. I know. So I'm trying to practice, you know, for when I'm older. Absolutely. Oh. I love Ramadan. It's my favourite time of the year. Is time, it? Yes, a time to get closer to Allah, learn about the lives of the Ahlul Bayt. Mm. I get really sad when the month comes to an end. How can you be so excited about Ramadan? I love it. Aren't you silly? Mm. Oh, mm. sorry, aren't you like, like, not silly, what's the word? Tired, hungry. No, Pip. Actually, I've got the girls coming over tonight. Yep, Francesca, Zainab, Ruby. Ruby? I can't wait. Guess what I've got on the menu. Do you know what? What? I really don't want to know. No, if last night was anything to go by, I went to Ahmed's place for iftar and his mum cooked. Yeah. Oh, my God. Ugh. Oh my goodness, what happened? You're about to burst into tears. No, I can't talk about it, it's too painful. Pip, come here, come a bit closer. You can always talk to me, you know we're good friends. Oh, it was the food, Layla. What happened? It was awful, I mean I could cook something a lot better blindfolded. Oh. Pip, I thought something serious had happened. I don't like where this is going, but carry on. I did promise I'd listen. It wasn't the sort of food you could give a monster. He was half starving. Oh, no Pip. No way. Oh, Pip. Where was the pizza? The pasta? No, it wasn't. It was just, just not nice food. So is this what you did when you were there and you had the food in your mouth? What? You were chewing really slowly, That's weren't you? That's it. And then my mum kept looking at me. Yeah. She was trying to tell me to be polite. Yeah. But you know, with her face and eyes. What you mean, like this? No, a bit more like this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's how. Aww. Oh, Bip, what you did was very unkind. And maybe even hurtful, especially if Ahmed's mum realised that you didn't like her cooking. Oh, I couldn't help it. I had to say something. You mean you actually told her her food wasn't nice? And how did you say it, Pip? Oh, when I said, I can't eat this. Are you kidding me? Yeah, just like that. And it just came out with it. I mean, oh, I, was, I could have said more. I could have said, where's the pasta? Where's the pizza? I've been starving all day. And then you invite me to your house. And then in order for you to invite me to your house, you give me this food. Pip, there's a way to behave when you visit someone in their home. Don't you know that? Oh, Layla, what is that way? I didn't know. Pip, I want you to listen to what I've... Uh, what I have to tell you about what, how one should behave when they're invited over to someone's house. Okay, I'll listen. Have I done something wrong, though? Melina, I know it's Ramadan. Oh, no, I might have hurt her feelings. Pip, you know you were very, very fortunate to have something to eat during Ramadan because many, many people don't. Oh, I think... I think I've done something very bad, Layla. Pip, it's okay. Honestly, we all make mistakes. Now listen closely. There are many manners about eating that we yeah, should there remind. There are many manners, Layla. You know what? Yes. Yeah, that you know we what, Layla? Yes. Do you know what the manner is for eating? What I think the manner is for eating. What do you think the manner is? I call it seafood. Oh yeah. Do you know what seafood is? No. Well, it's not like seafood, like. I Water food. Right. But it's like when you see food, yeah. you eat it. No. Yes. No, no, that's yum, not... yum, 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 yum. No. That's what I'm like. Iftar time. I wait for the clock. Yes. And then when it's iftar time, yes. like time to munch. Yes. I sit there. Yes. And I wait. Yes. And I'm like, tick, 
tock, tick, tock. Yes. Bring! It's time to eat. Oh, nom, 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 right. nom. That's no, my manners. Pip. No, that's not what I was going to say. There are many manners about eating, and we should remind them. We, we should remind ourselves of them, especially during this blessed well, month of Ramadan. Well, well, well. You can remind yourself, and you can teach me because I don't know. Okay. Well, let's look at the example of our of our holy prophet. Peace and blessings be upon him and his holy family. Oh, is it a story, Layla? Well, it's more like advice and guidance, but yes, it's a story oh, too. Oh, advice, that means good words. You That's told me right. last time. That's right. Okay. When our prophet put food to his mouth, he would say, Bismillah. Bismillah. I know what that means, Leila. Yes, what does it I mean? I learnt it at mosque. What, really? In the masjid, they told me Bismillah means in the name of Allah. That's right, Pip. I love to smile when I say Bismillah. Aww. Do you like it, Leila? I love saying Bismillah. Let's say it together. Do the children at home say Bismillah? Do you? Leila, let's see. Bismillah. Bismillah. Layla, can you continue? I'm yes, I can. That. And he told people to say this when eating. Really? When any one of you um, begin to eat, always mention the name of Allah. But Layla, Layla, and some, if you wait, wait, wait. Yes. Sometimes yes. I forget to say Bismillah when I start eating. That's okay. What you really? can do, you can say it during your meal or right at the end. Really? Did the Prophet say that? Yes, he did. Oh my it's God. It's normal to forget. Even I forget sometimes. That's so nice. Yes. Layla, yes. I really try and remember to say Bismillah before I eat. But sometimes I forget, you know. Oh, that's okay. Well, I'll remember this hadith, especially in Ramadan. Yes. It's a good time to practice this, you know. Okay. That's great, Pip. Oh. Sometimes I forget too, so for it's you. a reminder for me as well. Lady, you forget too sometimes. Yes, I do. I think we all just forget sometimes. Yes. When the Prophet lifted food to his mouth, he would say, All praise is for Allah, the good and the blessed. And lastly, Pip, he never said anything hurtful to anyone who cooked food to him, for him. If he didn't like it, he would leave it, but if he did like it, he would eat it. And if he didn't want to eat, he would say, I'm not really hungry at the moment. Or oh, he wouldn't say, well, this is absolutely atrocious food. I'm not standing for this. No, he wouldn't say anything like that. He wouldn't say, oh, where's my pasta? Where's my pizza? No. I don't like this lamb. No. I don't like this meat. No. Oh, the Prophet's so kind and generous and caring. He was. He's always thinking about people's feelings. Absolutely. And, um, oh. Lena. Yes. I don't think I've been very nice to Ahmed's mom. No, you haven't, Pip. Um, but you can apologise. Layla. But I really, really felt like she could have cooked more at least. Or well, something look, much nicer. Why don't you invite her round for a nice iftar meal one day during the week? That's such a nice idea. And then I can cook. And yes. Then help my mum. Yes. You know, to cook. Absolutely. And probably... I know that you can apologize. cook some dishes. Yes, you can. You can apologise to I, her. I, do you know what, Layla? Yes. I learnt the recipe for monster jelly. <gasps> oh, it sounds delicious. Do you put ice cream on it? Not in monster land. Oh, I'm sorry. I no, didn't realise. We put dates in our jelly. Oh, can I have some? What? Just a little bit. A little bit of what? Monster jelly. No, because we're not a monster. So. Oh. <laughs> oh. Anyway, Layla. But Pip, if there is all about... I can make you something. I can make you some uh, nice jelly. Oh. Because you're a nice person. Oh, oh. thank you. <laughs> anyway, Leila, let's... Anyway, you know let's remember the words and advice of our holy prophet, peace okay, be upon then. him. Leila, can I say it? Yes, go on then. Okay, so before we start our meal, we should yes. say Bismillah. That's right. Yeah. Before we start our meal, we should say Bismillah. That's right. And even if we forget it, mm -hmm. during the meal and we remember halfway through or at the end, mm -hmm. we should also say Bismillah. That's right? right. Then on top of that, yes. children, remember yes. to thank Allah for the food he's given us. Absolutely. And if somebody doesn't invite us around their house and we don't like the food, yes. we shouldn't be mean. No. We should just say, oh, sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm full at the moment. Maybe no. I'll eat later. Okay. Or we just eat the food and just act like it's, it's nice because I'm... I'm sure it's, 
other people don't have that food, Leila, you know that. I know, we're very, very lucky that we have a meal to look forward to at well, the I end of the day. I can't wait for Iftar, Leila. I know, I can't I'm wait so for... I'm so hungry! Let's, let's, let's go, go home and have... Home. Oh, you want to come to mine? But you've got the girls coming. Oh, home. you can come over, I'm sure they'll enjoy oh, having your company. Thank you, Leila. Oh. Can I have a hug? Of course you can. Oh. Oh. No. Oh. oh, thank you. Okay. Right, that's all we have time for, children. <laughs> Make sure you try and keep your fast. And remember the advice that Leila's given to us from the prophet. Thank yes. you, Leila. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you, Pip, for listening. Oh. Thank you, children. Thank, thank you, you, children. Master I hope you have a pizza and pasta after.